All right, welcome back, everybody. Uh, this is take two. Uh, got some explaining to do. Uh, first, I got a copyright when I was trying to, uh, well, after I loaded on a song, Let Her Go. Supposed to be copyright free, but it's not in some uh, some countries. But anyway, I've been in the hospital for a few days. Uh, Mr. Yankee and Colin Julian, uh, as you can see there, they had a wreck a little bit before I fell in the pond. So, uh, yeah, I lost my foot and fell in the pond. And, plus, I got thinking about the price of the excavator replacing that stuff. And I just I blacked out, I guess, and hit my head on the gravel. But, anyway, uh, I don't know really what happened with the wreck with Colin Jr. and Mr. Yankee. They, uh, I heard something about a tractor, or not tractor, but something hit the tractor spun it sideways and, and the semi was right behind them and the tractor just spin around facing the semis and, and kept going and it just you know it's one of those freak accidents that happened <sighs> but yeah so i'm recording over this because the song was copyrighted but Folks, the, the price of an excavator is going to take a lot of money. I end up selling the tractor, uh, I think, for 10000 or something like that. And, you know, the excavator is going to be, uh, I'm going to have to pay quite a bit for it. And plus, I lost a contract. The guy backed out of the contract, in other words because uh, of all was going on and stuff, so I got to pay for the gravel and the dirt and all that that I put down, you know. I bought it out of my pocket, and he was going to reimburse me and stuff, but now I kind of got messed up out of the deal, so I'm going to have to pay for all that. Plus, I didn't have insurance on uh, any of the guys, my girls and stuff like that, so... But anyway, I don't know what all's been cut out of this, what's left. I haven't really rewatched it but uh boo boo jr christy no star reviews ice demon all, all of them helped me well they done it themselves put all the stuff in the farm shop 
I locked it up and stuff. But, uh, yeah, I'm fixing to have the recording I done the first time. Uh, I cut the little section out for the copyright, so you fixing to hear it. So I'm going to shut up and let y'all hear the original here in just a second. All right. All right, that was the tractor and the excavator. I can't find the truck, but I didn't get very much out of the truck either. And, um, the trailer was messed up too. Um, the frame was warped on it. It was still could have been used like out in the road and stuff. Or not, not the road, but like out here on the back roads. But anyway, so the let's go over here and I'll show you what we got left. The trailer with the red flags, it is one that was gone. Uh, the truck and that tractor and, and of course that big excavator. Um, got some bad news on the. Uh, Oh, I can't even think what it's called. The silo over by the marketplace. Um, that construction area where the excavator was sitting. And that guy backed out of the deal. So, I'm having to pay for all the dirt and gravel and stuff that was brought into there. So, yeah, I, I'm in debt bad. I'm probably going to have to sell quite a bit of this equipment. Um, I do have, I got this here. I got that truck. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, I got this flatbed. Uh, I still got basically a lot of the equipment. Um... The 4955 and the mowers. You got the combine. Uh, what was that? The 6M? I can't remember. Yeah, the 6250R. And I got the brand new drill that we didn't even use. Um, no Star Reviews and Christy. Uh, Larry and Boo, Boo Jr., uh, Betsy, all of them helped to put this equipment inside here. Um, I didn't get a list of what all is still around, but it looks like we got everything but the header, the header for the combine. I sold it. Must have got this frat bed. We got our tipper back here. We got both of the dump trailers, the fuel trailer, Herbert side here. Still got a lot of feed for the chickens. And we got the 4960 in the grain cart. But folks, I, I've got to get through the medical bills get processed since uh, Colin and Mr. Yankee didn't have insurance, neither did I which was a big no-no on my part <sighs> I gotta pay for their medical bills, which that's only right that is only right, I have to do that I gotta get the bill in on what mine's gonna be so yeah I, I'm not even supposed to be out doing anything but I think I'm going to go back inside the house. Um, ow. Oh, forgot the door opens that way. But anyway, I do have one more truck up there. It's got the log trailers on it. The first trailer is loaded with logs. Um, and then we got our hay bales to sell. So that'll bring in some money. 
what I got right now will probably just cover the excavator. So yeah. But folks, I'm sorry I rambled so much as pretty much just explain where I'm standing, I guess. Standing on one foot seems like. It's a beautiful day and we just got to make the best of it. So yeah, I'm gonna go back in. I'm gonna end this episode here. I'm going to do all the gathering of the bills and stuff. And I'll see you on the next day or two. And by the way, it's late winter. And it is cold out here, folks. <laughs> anyway, y'all have a great day. A blessed day. And I'll see y'all on the next episode. Probably selling some equipment. Later.